Peter from First Maths and today we're looking at Year 4 Block 1 Assessment Paper 1 Answers after each question Question 1 Using these three numbers complete the addition and subtraction sentences below 27, 19 and 8 While you only need to do one sum for A and one sum for B. There are two answers for A and there are two answers for B. Pause the video until you are ready for the answer. Here comes the answer. The answers are 19 plus 8 equals 27. Or the other A, 8 plus 19 equals 27. The two answers for B are 27 minus 19 equals 8, or 27 minus 8 equals 19. Let's look at question 2. Question 2. Draw a line to match each of the numbers to the nearest 10. For example, 426, the nearest 10. 426 is 430. What is 434 rounded to the nearest 10? What is 417 rounded to the nearest 10? What is 398 rounded to the nearest 10? What is 402 rounded to the nearest 10? Pause the video until you are ready for the answer. Here comes the answer. Answer. 426 rounded to the nearest 10 is 430. 434 rounded to the nearest 10 is also 430. 417 rounded to the nearest 10 is 420. 398 rounded to the nearest 10 is 400. 402 rounded to the nearest 10 is 400. Let's look at the next question. Question 3. Write the number that should go in the empty box. 3246 equals 3000 plus something plus 40 plus 6. Pause the video until you are ready for the answer. Here comes the answer. 3246 equals 3000 plus 200 plus 40 plus 6. Let's look at the next question. Question 4. Write the number which is 10 more than 700 B. 100 more than 54 C. 10 less than 880 and D. 100 less than 211. Pause the video until you are ready to see the answer. Here come the answers. Answer A. 10 more than 700 is 710. B. 100 more than 54 is 154. C. 10 less than 880 is 870. And D. 100 less than 211 is 100. And Let's look at the next question. Question 5. Continue the sequence. What is happening to these numbers? 15, 30. 30 goes to something, something goes to 120. And 120 goes to something. Pause the video and answer the question. When 
you are ready for the answers, press play. Here comes the answer. 15 to 30. So 15 is doubling to make 30. So double 30 makes 60. Double 60 makes 120. Double 120 makes 240. Let's look at the next question. Question 6. Work out answers to the following. What is 672 plus 53? And B. What is 367 plus 186. Pause the video until you are ready for the answer. Here comes the answer. Answer. The answer was 725. And that was worked out by going 2 plus 3 makes 5. 7 plus 5 makes 12. So you put the 2 and we put 1 up here. And 1 plus 6 makes 7. And in this case it was B 553. And that is because 7 plus 6 makes 13. So you put the 3 there. Keep 1 up here. Which makes 1 plus 6 plus 8. Which makes 15. One there, so one plus three plus one makes five. Let's look at the next question. Question seven. Complete this multiplication grid. So all you do is one times three makes this. Two times three makes six. Two times ten makes twenty. Fill in the multiplication grid. Pause the video until you are ready for the answer. Here comes the answer. One times three is three. One times four is four. One times ten is ten. Two times three is six. Two times four is eight. 2 times 10 is 20. 5 times 3 is 15. 5 times 4 is 20. 5 times 10 is 50. 10 times 3 is 30. 10 times 4 is 40. 10 times 10 is 100. Let's look at the next question. Question. 8a. You have a rectangle with its, which is 20 centimeters long and 18 centimeters wide. You also have an equilateral triangle with 5 centimeters each side. What is the perimeter of the rectangle? What is the perimeter of the equilateral triangle? Pause the video until you are ready to see the answer. Here come the answers. A. The rectangle had 76 centimeters and the triangle had 15 centimeters. You will need these numbers for the next question. So I would make a note of them somewhere. Here comes the next question. What is the difference in length of the two perimeters? You could either work it out again or use the answers from the previous question. Pause the video until you know the answer. Here comes the answer. The difference was 61 centimetres. Let's look at the next question. Question 9. Three lengths of wood 
were put together. How long was the length of wood? Show your work. The first piece of wood was 1 meter 15 centimeters long. The second piece of wood was 150 centimeters long. And the third piece of wood was half a meter long. Pause the video until you want to see the answers. Here comes the answer. The answer was 3 meters 15 centimeters long or 315 centimeters or 3.15 meters. And make sure you use any correct method to solve it. Here comes the next question. Question 10. Martin has £2.98. He wants to buy a football which costs £3.45. How much more money does he need? Show you're working. You may get a mark. OK. Pause the video until you are ready to see the answer. Here comes the answer. The answer was 47 pence using any correct method. Question 11. Write a number on each blank card so that the five cards are in order. 699 something 1010 something 1060 Pause the video until you are ready to see the answers. Here come the answers. Any number from 700 to 1099 inclusive. Any number from 1011 to 1059 inclusive. Here comes the next question. Question 12. Write these numbers in order, from the smallest to the largest. Pause the video until you are ready to see the answers. Here comes the answers. Answer. The smallest was 55. The next smallest? 405, then 504, and the largest was 505. Let's look at the next question. Question 13. Draw the reflection of this shape using the line of symmetry. You may use a mirror. Pause the video until you are ready to look at the answer. Here comes the answer. Thank you for watching. This is the end of the test. If you liked this video, please give it a like below. I love seeing how many people like what I'm trying to do. If you would like to know when I make my next video, please subscribe to my channel and also press the notification bell to be informed every time I upload a maths resource. Thank you again and I hope to see you again soon. Bye!